You are ready to buy a house, but not sure how to select the best lender for you. I am Carissa Wright, Broker Associate at Beach City Brokers in Redondo Beach. And in this video, I'm going to discuss with you the different types of lenders and how to best select a lender to fit your needs. Now, before we dive in, if you haven't already hit subscribe, please do so. New videos coming out each week on real estate topics. So let's go ahead and dive in. When my clients are coming to me and they say that they need to buy, but they haven't been pre-approved yet, the first question I always like to ask is, what is your employment type? Are you a self-employed individual, independent contractor, 1099, K2, or are you an employee of a company? Maybe you receive a W-2 at the end of each year. Starting with our self-employed individuals, again, 1099, K2, also some of my more unique buyers. So maybe you don't have great credit. Maybe you're transitioning jobs. So you don't have income now, but you will, that you have a lot of reserves, money ready to go. You can still buy more of my creative types, right? I always recommend that we start with a mortgage broker for you. Now, a mortgage broker is an intermediary between the borrower slash buyer and lenders. So the benefit of working with a mortgage broker is that you get to have the broker compare multiple loan programs for you to find the one to best fit your needs. Now, moving over to our W-2 types, a little bit more straightforward, maybe you have really good credit, you have a long um, career path, you've been at the same company for many years, I should say. More of my straightforward borrowers, right? Your best option is to go with the bank where you tend to carry your balances. So the bank where you already have a relationship. And these are your Chase, your Bank of America, Wells Fargo. And the reason I usually recommend starting there is that these banks are giving you the loan and because you already have a relationship, they typically can give you the best rate on the market. Now, as a borrower, I always recommend having a conversation with more than one lender, right? You want to make sure that you are getting the best loan. This is a big purchase you're making. So according to the Consumer Finance Protection Bureau, if you do multiple credit inquiries for the same type of loan, so a mortgage loan, within 14 to 45 days, it is only considered to be one inquiry. And this is to allow you to really make sure that you are finding the best loan, best rate, least number of points, etc. So I always recommend having a conversation with more than one lender, even based off of the information that I'm giving you. Now, the last thing I wanna say is that your realtor, if it's not me, should always be helping you with this process. You don't need to do this alone. Your realtor should have contacts. They should be able to make introductions. They should be having this conversation with you. And again, always double check, make sure that you are getting the absolute best loan product to fit your needs.